I'm Jamie Zebra 23 welcome to my channel. Um, if you'd like a personal reading, you can check out the website, jamiezebra23.com. My readings are 20 minutes, 40 minutes, and 60 minutes. I typically do your readings within 24 to 48 hours. I also have a new feature, same day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. I also have an $8 one question, one answer via email only. I typically answer you within about 20 minutes. So um, please be sure to write your email addresses correctly so that I can email you back. Also on the website, um, I have incense. Sage, Florida water, Florida water soap, um, crystals, crystals, <laughs> stones, pendants, um, pendants. I have uh, pendulums for divination and prophecy. I've got full size candles. I've also got a 10 minute tarot card reading for $25. It's not the reading special, it's something different. This is something that will be on the website every day from now on. I'm jamiezebra23.com. Please like, share, subscribe, comment. Ta ta for now. Hi, my Scorpios. It's jamiezebra23. I'm doing your weekly spread for the week of November 25th, 2019, for my Scorpio Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers. Um, keep in mind that these are general readings, so they may or may not resonate. So please be sure to check out your Sun, your Moon, and your Rising videos for further insight. All right, so Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers week of November 25th, 2019. This is what we have going on. All right. All right, so you guys have good news coming your way. So if you guys were applying for something, if you were hoping for an opening at a daycare, if you were hoping, if you were hoping that something would come through for the better. You guys have good news this week. Especially if that um, if that good news, you needed it to come from a fire sign, from a Sagittarius or Aries, or this has to do with the holidays at all, like Christmas or New Year's, you have a good news. For some of you, you're planning a New Year's Eve wedding, a New Year's Day wedding. For some of you, you're planning a Christmas wedding, or something's happening on Christmas, maybe a baby shower, maybe a baby's being born on that day. Um, but either way, some of you are, are anticipating that. Um, for some of you, I'm seeing that you can schedule, that you're scheduling that somehow. Maybe you're, they're going to, you know, want to induce and they're going to ask you what day you want. I feel like some of you, you're going to choose that it's going to be, um, um, December 25th, Christmas day. All right. So now let's see what else is going on here. So for those of you that are not pregnant, you still have good news coming. I also feel like you guys are, um, I feel like you guys you're, you're, you've kept the faith, you're, you've stayed positive, slowly but surely things are going better for you. I also feel when it comes to schooling this week, if you're going to school or you have a youngster that goes to school or maybe a not so youngster that's going to school, I feel like the grades are gonna be good if you guys are waiting for loans, student loans to come through. If you're waiting for some sort of checks to come through, I feel like you're gonna get that. It keeps showing me academics. All right, now, I'm. I'm lighting sage in the background. That's what that noise is. But the uh, but the blocks. That's those are kids' blocks. They're playing. Um, so yeah. So it's same old, same old, same kind of things going on in my videos as they always happen. All right. So we got the Ace of Cups here. It will be a very happy and positive week. There will be several people trying to break your happiness this week. Maybe people messing with your head. Maybe people being annoying. Or you may have um, something. Okay. So this is a real channel. So I have to tell you what I'm seeing. I, I can't, you know, I can't play pretend. All right, so some of you, maybe somebody has passed away and you're having a rough week because of it. Keep in mind, guys, this person would have already passed away. This isn't something that's happening this week. This already happened and you're already grieving, which I don't need the emails. So please, everything's fine. Everybody's fine. Everything's going to be all right. But some of you are grieving. You're grieving this week and it's and you're not doing so well or you have a partner that's grieving and they're not doing so well this week but some somebody's definitely upset this week um, but i feel like it will be a happy week otherwise but there's going to be some triggers and some things that are making you guys a little bit upset this week now i do see that things are going to be moving at a very very fast paced pace coming next week or the end of this week Things are going to start moving for the better. I feel like in love and romance, things are going to move. Things are going to move forward for the better. So let's say you're single, or you're in a little bit of a dilemma, or you're in a little bit of limbo. You're going to be getting out of that, and you're going to be moving towards who you think you should be. So let's say there's four people in mind who you could date. Scorpio, it looks like you're going to finally pick one. If there's somebody who wants to divorce you this week, you're going to say, you know what? Fine. You want a divorce? I'll give you a divorce. Some of you were like, fine, okay? You think I'm never going to find somebody? You think I'm going to be single for the rest of my life? Okay, well, I'll prove it to you. 
hurry up and sign the divorce paper so that I can marry somebody else. So there's going to be somebody that is going to get into a, a good relationship, a positive relationship with someone just out of spite because you don't want to be with them. So cross watchers, if you were telling a Scorpio you do not want to be with them anymore, they just might go get themselves a husband, a new husband or a new wife just to prove to you that uh, you're not the only person in the world. Um, you know, Scorpio, if you're trying to, you know, leave somebody, they might be the ones that go try to get a husband or a wife real quick to prove to you that they're not going to be lonely forever. So it's up to you what you want to do about this. It's your choice. So just, you know, don't, don't play games. If you really want it to be over, let it be over, but don't get, don't get mad once this person moves on because they will move on. Now let's talk about something else. Okay. I do see with the seven of cups here, you guys have all these plans and all these ideas, but you just don't have the time or the energy. You have to delegate. I'm seeing you, some of you need to advertise. Some of you need to prepare things. Some of you want to maybe even make YouTube videos or Facebook videos. Some of you have your own small business. Maybe you sell Mary Kay. You know, maybe you sell insurance and you guys need to be posting more. You need to do this, you need to do that. There's a lot of things that need to get done, but you have a life. You maybe even have a full-time job. You know, you got issues of your own and it's hard for you to do this. But it's saying this week, if you can possibly swing it, try to get, you know, try to get this thing going. It looks like it'll be for the best. If you can't do it, of course, things are going to stay slow and things just won't get off the ground. So try to delegate. If, you know, a lot of people on YouTube, I've noticed, um, they have their young sons and daughters, like their 13 year olds, you know, and up doing a lot of the creative work, the, um, the editing to the videos, the posting on social media. Um, so if you have a young adult, maybe if they know how to do it, have them do it. Um, I can't wait till mine is, you know, old enough to do this stuff. I'm going to have him do it. I can't wait. I can't wait till one of them's old enough to drive the car. I can just sit back in the back seat and play with my phone. Oh yeah. <laughs> Good times. Good times. I'm waiting. <laughs> All right, guys, Jamie Zebra 23. I'm um, having an amazing week. Please like share, subscribe and comment.